Alright, and we're back, JR. I'm trying to focus the camera, but my camera does not want to focus at all. So, the pictures might be blurry a little, a little bit, but this is the best that it wants to focus. I don't know why it's not focusing. Padme, I'll add Emadala. Ahsoka Tano. Another Princess Leia Organa. Lando Calrissian. And a blue FN2187. And it's not numbered. That's cool. You get a uh, you get a different colored card. All right, next pack. Han Solo, Boba Fett, C three PO, Bib Fortuna, Count Dooku, Kylo Ren, Purple Darth Vader, and then the Resistance Millennium Falcon. Evolution of Ships and Vehicles. Refractor card, I think. Nope, it's base. And the purples aren't numbered either. So, so far you got a blue and a purple. And if I see a hit, I'm going to save the hits to the end. Or I might, I don't know. I don't know what I want to do with that yet. Count Dooku, Boba Fett, Supreme Chancellor Palpatine, Luke Skywalker, Obi-Wan Kenobi, Padme Amidala, Star Wars Knights of the Republic comic card, and Chewbacca. Blue. And that Star Wars One Republic is called Star Wars Evolution of Comics. Yeah, seeing what base they have in here, it'd be really nice to pull a autograph. Uh, Yoda, Anakin Skywalker, another Chewbacca, Clone Trooper, R2-D2, Bib Fortuna, Darth Vader's lightsaber card, and A-T-T-E Walker, Evolution of Ships and Vehicles card. Next pack. Mace Windu, Finn, Darth Maul, Boba Fett, Han Solo, Luke Skywalker, Yoda, Blue Padme Amidala, and you have a free pack of Star Wars digital trading cards. So I was I'm surprised they um that's cool actually. Because they had those in the blaster boxes of the Force Awakens Series 1. And they are actually bringing them back for the um, more expensive hobby packs. So I think that that's actually really cool. It's a good way to get, you know, free stuff. Yoda, Padme Amidala, Anakin Skywalker, Wilhoff Tarkin. C-3PO, R2-D2, Purple Princess Leia Organa, and AT-AT, Evolution of Ships and Vehicles card. Next pack. Naboo, Senator Palpatine, Obi-Wan Kenobi, Princess Leia Organa, Obi-Wan Kenobi again, Han Solo, Chewbacca, Stormtrooper, and ATRT, Evolution of Ships and Vehicles card. So what's cool is, if, if you haven't noticed already, the cards...
feature the characters throughout all of the movies, which I think is actually relatively cool. Ahsoka Tano, Padme Amidala, Luke Skywalker, Han Solo, Chewbacca, Stormtrooper, another comic card, or either that or a concept art card. Nope, it's, it's comics. Star Wars Dark Horse. And blue, Supreme Chancellor, Chancellor Palpatine. Alright, and that was the Force Awakens. That was the whole stack of, or, or not the Force Awakens, that was the whole stack of the Vintage Stormtrooper packs. Now we're going to do the Clone Troopers and see if we have any luck of them. And then we'll save the Force Awakens Stormtroopers for the end. We'll do those packs last. Alright, first pack. Now you could pull more than two hits, but it says you're you have two hits guaranteed. Mace Windu, Ray, Chewbacca, Emperor Palpatine, Princess Leia Organa, Yoda, Darth Vader, and Speeder Bike, Evolution of Ships and Vehicles. And the base cards actually aren't half bad either. They, uh, they, they're really good pictures of the characters. And they're actually pretty cool to get autographed if you're into doing that, JR. I don't, um, I don't collect much Star Wars stuff, but they are pretty cool cards. Han Solo, Princess Leia Organa. Yoda, Darth Vader, Anakin Skywalker, Supreme Chancellor Palpatine, Rey, and Blue Boba Fett. Next pack. Mace Windu, FN 2187, Count Dooku, Boba Fett, Supreme Chancellor Palpatine, Luke Skywalker, another evolution of comic card, and blue Obi-Wan Kenobi. And of course you're going to have some of the base cards repeat because it is a hobby box, but the good thing is with the hobby box is you have a good chance of pulling the or not pulling, but um, getting a majority of the base set. Anakin Skywalker. This this pack feels a little thick when I opened it. Yoda. Anakin Skywalker. Chewbacca. Clone Trooper. R two D two. And I'm gonna see if there's nope. There is no hit. Luke Skywalker. His lightsaber and TIE Fighter, Evolution of Ships and Vehicles card. So that was weird. It, it felt like there was something really thick in there, but it ended up being just base. They like and try and trick you, too. But yeah, I'd take any of these autographs, Darth Maul, of the um, characters, because actually it's not a bad base set for getting autographs. Canon Jaros... Lando Calrissian, Leia Organa, Luke Skywalker, Yoda, another Evolution of Comics card, and Blue Mace Windu. So, nothing yet. As far as the hits go, but they should be coming up relatively soon. Ahsoka, Ahsoka Tano, Han Solo. Well, look at how young Harrison Ford looks in that card. Chewbacca, Lando Calrissian, C-3PO, Mace Windu, Finn. And X-Wing Evolution of Ships and Vehicles card.
Yoda, Darth Vader, Anakin Skywalker, Naboo Senator Palpatine, Obi-Wan Kenobi, Princess Leia Organa, Obi-Wan Kenobi again, and Blue Han Solo. And I don't think that there's redemption cards for autographs in this product. I really don't know, because this is this is actually the um, only second time I've opened this product, and the first time was a while back, so I kind of forget. C-3PO, Mon Mothma, Darth Vader, Padme Am Amidala, Wilhuff Tarkin, R2-D2, Jabba the Hutt, and Luke's Landspeeder, Evolution of Ships and Vehicles card. So it looks like both your hits are in the last stack of packs, and that is the Force Awakens Stormtrooper. So good luck, JR, on your two hits, and hopefully we can pull you something, something really good. R2-D2, Emperor Palpatine, Lando Calrissian, Anakin Skywalker, Obi-Wan Kenobi, Luke Skywalker, another evolution of comics card, and Blue Count Dooku. Han Solo, Chewbacca, Stormtrooper, Mace Windu, FN2187, Kylo Ren and Captain Phasma, oh that's cool, um, 6 of 9, I don't know what this card is exactly called, but it's see-through, that is really cool. I don't think that's not a hit. And Anakin Speeder Evolution of Ships and Vehicles card. It's not a it yeah, it's there's no way that's a hit. I'm gonna put it off to the side, just in case if it is. But it it I don't think it would be. But that is that is a really, really cool card. I've never I've never seen it before. And it is really really cool okay and you have an autograph in this pack Darth Maul Boba Fett Han Solo Luke Skywalker Yoda Anakin Skywalker Blue Stormtrooper and your autograph is we're going to slow roll it here. And it is of Queen Apollana. Portrayed by the actress Keisha Castle Hughes. So not a bad autograph. It is of a of a main character, which is good. Padme Amidala, Anakin Skywalker, Wilhoff Tarkin, C-3PO, R2-D2, Kylo Ren, Canon Jarrus, and Imperial Shuttle Evolution of Ships and Vehicles card. And the good news is, is that you still have one hit, unless that Captain Phasma and Kylo Ren card was a hit, but... Like I said, I don't think that it was, so you could pull another autograph. Bib Fortuna, Darth Maul, Canon Juros, Lando Calrissian, Leia Organa, Luke Skywalker, another evolution of comics card, and uh, Soka Tano. Blue.
Obi-Wan Kenobi, Padme Amidala, Ahsoka Tano, Han Solo, Chewbacca, Lando Calrissian, C-3PO, and Millennium Falcon Evolution of Ships and Vehicles card. Two packs left. Jabba the Hutt, Clone Trooper, Wilhoff Tarkin, Boba Fett, Mon Mothma, Count Dooku, Kanan Jerus, Lightsaber, and Kylo Ren's Command Shuttle. Alright, JR, and this is the last pack. You do have a hit in this pack. Anakin Skywalker, Luke Skywalker, and your hit is TIE Fighter Pilot, the First Order Commemorative Flag Patch Card. Not a bad hit. Is it numbered? Yes. 9 of 25. So, really cool looking card. Not bad. Not bad, not bad. So you did end up pulling three very nice cards. You got the TIE Fighter Pilot First Order Commemorative Flag Patch Card. You did pull one autograph of Keisha Castle Hughes as Queen Apiolana. And then you got this really cool Kylo Ren and Captain Phasma see-through card. And it's number six of nine, which means that it's a set. And you ended up pulling some very nice base cards. You got a lot of colored cards. And I think you did actually relatively good. So we thank you for doing this break with Autograph Central Collectibles and Supplies. And JR, I will ship these cards out today. Um, as you can see, it is currently... 103 p.m. and I'm gonna try and ship these out before 5 I should be able to but if for some reason I don't I will uh, ship them out tomorrow for sure alright thank you JR for doing another break with us we greatly appreciate your business and hopefully you come back and do another break with us whether it is evolution or if it's uh, the force awakens but I think you did really good like I said earlier in this video um, with this break. Alright, JR, take care and thank you again for doing this break with Autograph Central Collectibles and Supplies. We greatly appreciate your business. Have a good day.